Okay, so this is the view from outside my hotel. I'll show you around a little bit. I was just gonna get some, that's my hotel. But I was just gonna go get some breakfast um, over there. And then I'll show you what I get. Okay, so a little update. Um, I'm trying to change my location of my hotel to one that's closer to the venue and we'll see if it's possible. Hopefully there's some rooms free so then I can be closer to the venue and yeah. So I got myself some buns. Um, this is what they look like. So that's what the inside. The inside is like onions and like pork and stuff. This is what it looks like on the outside. Um, this is kind of like the vibes. It was in there. Um, but yeah, this is sort of like what I'm eating right now. Very yummy. Highly recommend it. Um, and then I'm gonna go have a hit with one of the Egyptian girls in about like well, I would leave kind of soon, but yeah, uh, we'll see how this day goes. Okay, so just got back from hitting this morning. I hit for an hour and a half. Um, for some reason at the one hour point, I felt like really tired. My legs are a little sore, but like it's not like my match yesterday was really long or anything. It was about, I think, 20 minutes long and uh, I kind of feel sad about it with how short it was, but Anyways, um, I mean it was high intensity, I guess, but yeah, so it was like uh, we played an hour and a half and I say it was like a good session. Um, also, so this morning, uh, after getting, finishing breakfast, I um, went over to like a little shop, like uh, just close by, and bought this thing that a uh, grab driver recommended me. I can't read that, but it's like, it's basically what I had this morning, but like fried version. So, you know, I'm gonna test it out, see how I like it. And then maybe, uh, I don't know, go, I'll go around somewhere. We'll see. Oh, I do need to um, shower. And then, well, I already stretched. Maybe I'll like roll out a little bit and then eat. Yeah. Then maybe t take a, a small nap before, I think the, the matches start at five today and I wanna watch all of them. I mean, it's not like I have so much going on. Maybe, okay, you know what I'll do? Maybe take like a short nap and then and then we can go on an adventure. And then from there, wherever I am, we'll just go to the squash courts. Should I bring my stuff? Just in case I wanna hit. No. Uh, no, I, um, no, I won't bring my stuff. Um, but yeah, this update. Um, I'll see you guys later. Okay, bye. I'm back, I uh, took my shower, nice and refreshing, and then did a little bit of rolling, and then now we're going to do the taste test. So first up, I don't know, wait, how do we do, I think I figured out how to do this last time, right? Focus, I don't know how to change the focus. Ooh, there we go. Look at that beauty. So I don't know what this is, but it smells really good. It, it smells like savory. Mm. That's the inside. It was really good. It's just like, I think it's pork. Um, it's just like a little bit sweet. I 
um, the bread part is like nice and like buttery and flaky. Very nice. Now we got the other one that looks very similar. I think this one might be the chicken. Um, let's try it. Oh, all <gasps> over, over, over. Oh yeah, this is chicken. Look at it. Look at how good that looks. It it tastes just as good as it looks. It's so yummy. I think I might like the pork one just a little bit more though. This one, the the bread is definitely flakier. But it's really good. I forgot how uh, to rate the first one. The first one, I'd rate a solid 8.7 at least out of 10, which is a really, really high number. It's really good. And then the chicken, I'd rate an 8. Point, uh, 8.0 out of 10. Also really good. But like, not quite as flavorful um now we got i don't know what this is but ta -da! look at how good it looks you can hear it too I only got like a little bit of the inside oh. so far. I think it might be a slightly sweeter one. The bread is nice and flaky. Bread is a little flaky, but really yummy. I'm trying to figure out what this flavor is. Coconut, maybe? I'm not really sure. It's a very like subtle flavor. I like it though. I'd rate it a solid 7 out of 10. I like savory stuff more, so. Maybe, maybe if I had that one first, then it would be different since the uh, other two had such a strong flavor. Next up, we have... This one was called like mom's cake or something. I'm not really sure. Look at how beautiful that is. So glossy. Can you hear it too? It's a little it's a little poofy. Um yeah, it looks yummy. Mmm. I think this might also is supposed to be sweet or like, yeah, sweet. Mm. This is also a very like subtle flavor. Let me show you guys, hold on. Lots and lots of layers. The bread is really good. I say this is also a 7 out of 10. Really solid. Um, yeah. That's the food that I got today. Um, 
and then we'll go somewhere later even if it's just to like walk around so you guys can like kind of see the area a little bit okay bye okay so i woke up from my nap and i like absolutely passed out and i feel like maybe it might have been because of the food like it was like really good but it's like a little bit heavy too um it might also be because I these days I haven't been eating like meat very often and that had meat in it I feel like it just felt like really heavy and my body just wasn't used to that um, but uh, change of plans I'm actually going to re-watch my match from yesterday and then you know like take notes I guess like learn from it uh, and then after that probably head over Maybe do like a bit of like a band workout and then head over to the courts. Um, but yeah, so I'm not gonna go out, but there's always like the evening for dinner to do that too. Okay, um, I'll see you guys later. <laughs> okay, bye, bye Sorry for the change up like that, but yeah. Mmm, yes, squash. This is my setup. And it actually started raining outside, so I'm kind of glad, you know, I'm not not out there. Good call, bro. Good call. Um, but yeah, I'll continue studying. Okay, so I just got back from the courts, um, and then I was dropped off at my hotel. I'm gonna go get some dinner now. The camera's a little foggy because it's so cold in the squash courts. Um, so the camera itself, it's like cold right now and um, it fogged up the lens because it's warm outside. Uh, but yeah, so I'm gonna go to a restaurant that was recommended to me by one of my grab drivers. Um, so I keep saying Uber sometimes, that's just like out of habit. Uh, the app that they use here is called Grab, and yeah, so one of my Grab drivers, he recommended me this restaurant, and he told me to get fish head soup, or fish head noodle soup, I'm not really sure, I don't know, hopefully I ordered the right one, but he was saying it was really good, so this... Wow. Okay, wait. I'm gonna wait until the the camera is uh, warmed up and not fogged up like this. Okay, so it's warmed up a bit. Um, this is the restaurant. I'm just gonna go walk down the stairs over here and then get a spot and take my order. Okay, so my food's arrived. Um, it was actually the very first thing on the menu. It was fish head noodle, that's what it's called. So, this is what it looks like. Ooh, wow. There's some, uh, what do you call this? Chili and like garlic. Also, this is a t-shirt that, um, the tournament t-shirt that I got today. Uh, apparently last year's one was a lot cooler, but anyways, back to the food. So, this is what it looks like. Very nice. The steam's kind of fogging up the camera again. I'll put it into this bowl, and then I think that's where the, um, the bones go into. Dang, look at that. Um, but yeah, this is like the vibe. All these seats outside. Um, I'll let you know how I rate it. Okay? Okay, bye. Okay, so I finished eating. It felt like a freaking marathon. It was so much food, but it was so good. Now I'm like stuffed, and I know for a fact that I'm gonna get um, a. What is it? Uh, food coma later. Um, but yeah, look at this is the aftermath. Ta da! Fish bones, garlic, chili. Oh, yeah. Um, it's a nine out of ten. 
easy, an easy 9 out of 10. That was so good. I miss the, I miss the Penang portions though. The portions here in Sedemban are um, quite a bit bigger and I always struggle to finish and then I feel like really full. And I guess like I don't need to finish it but I don't know, like I paid for it and it's like good and I don't know, I, I don't want to like disrespect the people who made it by not finishing it, you know, making them think it's like not good. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna go pay at the counter now. That would be worth, so in US dollars, I think it'd be like four dollars maybe for all of that yeah I think it's maybe slightly less than four dollars but yeah that's uh, in Canadian dollars that would be three times no, three in Canadian dollars that would be about four dollars as well so US is slightly four Canada would be, I think, slightly more than four, but it's good. I really like it. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna go pay and then go to the counter and then I'll see you guys back at the hotel. So I'm back at the hotel now. Um, I feel that um, the food coma hitting and uh, yeah, that was a lot of food. <laughs> But it was really good. Um, yeah, I'm probably just gonna go to sleep. Um, I have a practice score tomorrow morning, and then uh, my friend might take me around, but also uh, I'm gonna watch some of the matches. Um, actually, with one of the matches today, uh, there's this player, um, his name's Ivan Nguyen, and he's, uh, I think he's the number two in Malaysia. Watching him play, I was just like, I've never seen anyone so smooth on court before, like in my life. Like he was just, he was just gliding, like he was just floating around the court. And he was so fast and he was getting everything back. And like, I've seen that before, like I've seen other players who are really fast, but with how effortless he looked and like, the thing is like the player that he was playing, um, Yannick, uh, I don't know how to pronounce his last name. The guy from Switzerland. Um, is this Switzerland? Yeah, I, th I think so. But anyways, um, like I have respect for him because I've seen him play before and he's like, he's really good. But then Ivan just like was always up by like five points and was just like cruising. So that was pretty insane to see. That's super cool. Like I want to be able to play like that. Oh, and also, so he's from like Penang and he would do like these really like casual soft drives to the back that were just like so perfect. That's like, it was, it was the shots that, um, that like Aaron's trying to teach me how to do. So I was seeing it in a match play, like in person for the first time ever and being able to see like a, a live example of that in a match, like in a tournament, was super cool and enlightening and you know, inspiring too. Yeah, not enlightening, inspiring. Um, so that was super cool. Uh, and I hope to be able to do that too, you know, like, cause he can like play really fast, but he can also like slow it down and his shot call was just so nice. And I was like, wow, this is what Warren and Aaron are trying to like teach me how to do. So, you know, now I have a match example and I'll maybe try to recreate that tomorrow in practice, you know? Um, but yeah, today was a really good day. Um, I'm looking forward to tomorrow and yeah. I hope you, I hope you guys uh, liked my uh, the content for. I don't even know what day it is today. Day four, maybe five. Nah, I don't know. <laughs> but yeah, miss you guys. I'll see you guys soon. Bye.